Sussex, uh, Mr Deputy Speaker, you will leave the chair for the last time. May I endorse what Mr Speaker said earlier, and on behalf of the whole House, thank you for your impartial, firm but courteous service for 13 years. Yeah. Uh, order. <laughs> I'm, I, I'm not sure that that wasn't grossly out of order, but... <laughs> can, 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 Mr. Bed, can... Further to that point of order, can I also uh, add the uh, congratulations and warm support for this side of the House as well, and our gratitude to you for your many years of kind consideration uh, for all members of this House, backbenchers and frontbenchers, and your fairness over the years as well. Yeah. Order, I fear this is getting worse. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Martin Hall, uh, can I also um, add uh, the congratulations on your service to this House from these benches on the Liberal Democrat side and uh, perhaps express the opinion that perhaps it was your early education in my own constituency that may have contributed to your excellent and uh, impartial service to this House. <laughs> well, uh, can I just uh, say to the House, I'm extremely grateful for those very kind words and the way that they were supported. Uh, it's been an exciting and privileged 13 years, and it will be uh, certainly in my memory, and I hope that I can continue to serve the House, perhaps in other ways. Order. Mr Stuart Housie. Thank you, Mr Speaker. I hope the clock doesn't start just yet. I want to pay my tribute uh, to you, uh, being the last person you called to speak in your current role, uh, and say that you've always been extraordinarily kind and generous to those on this benches. Yeah. 